Here we're told that we have the molecular weights of carbon and oxygen, so uh, 12 grams per mole and 16 grams per mole respectively. Uh, this comes from the periodic table, it's the molecular mass of carbon and oxygen respectively. And we're asked to find the specific volume in cubic meters per kilogram of carbon dioxide if its molar specific volume is 22.27 cubic meters per kilomole. So the first thing we're going to do on this problem is figure out the molecular weight of carbon dioxide. So we'll find the molecular weight of carbon dioxide. That's going to be the molecular weight of carbon because there's one carbon in carbon dioxide and two times the molecular weight of oxygen since there are two oxygens. So we're given that the molecular weight of carbon is 12.01 grams per mole and we have two oxygens so that's 16 grams per mole. And then when you work out the numbers for that, that comes out to be 44.01 grams per mole. Or written another way, that'd be 44.1 kilograms per kilomole. Basically, we're just multiplying the numerator and denominator by 1,000 to give us kilograms per kilomole. And then to find the specific volume in terms of cubic meters per kilogram, so converting it from, from the... Uh, 22.27 cubic meters per kilomole, what we're going to do is take this and divide it through by the molecular weight. So let me just show you that. So here's the specific volume. It's going to be the molar specific volume divided by the molecular weight of carbon dioxide. So the molar specific volume was 22.27 cubic meters per kilomole. We'll divide it by the 44.01 kilograms per kilomole. You can see the kilomoles cancel one another out, and then when you work out the numbers, that comes out to be 0 0.506 cubic meters per kilogram. 